In this video, we will show you how to get started with the Curiosity PIC32 MZEF 2.0 Development Boot using MPLAB Code Configurator, also known as MCC. Clone the MPLAB Harmony V3 repositories and install the software shown here. You can use MCC Content Manager to clone these Harmony packages. If you are new to MCC, be sure to watch these videos. You can find the links in the video's description. For this demonstration, we will use the PIC32 MZEF 2.0 development board. This project is based on a MIPS-based PIC32 MZ204 EF M144 MCU. This kit has an PKOB4 debugger. For more information, visit the kit page. The demo application reads the current room temperature from the IO1 Explain Pro extension kit. The temperature read is displayed on a serial console every 500 milliseconds. Also, LED 1 is toggled every time the temperature is displayed on the serial console. To achieve this, we will set up the hardware, download the project from the kit page, open the project and launch MCC, check the peripheral configurations in the MCC, compile the project and see the output. Let us set up the hardware as shown to test functionality. To get started developing applications on this board, open the web page for this evaluation kit shown here. Download the zip file for the getting started demo project. First, extract the demo firmware and open the project in MPLABX ID. Go to Tools, Embedded and Open MCC, which will open the project graph. Here, you can see the various peripherals configured for the PIC32 MZEF MCU. The UART6 is configured as USART to print LED toggling rate and temperature values. I2C1 is configured as I2C master to read temperature values from IO1 Explain Pro extension kit. The timer is configured to generate 500 milliseconds timeout interrupt. You can configure other system specific peripherals using the drop down menu. Click on clock configuration, which opens the clock easy view window. Here, the main clock is set to the default clock frequency of 200 MHz. Click on pin configuration. In the pin settings tab, you can see that the pin configurations such as RG4 is configured for switch SW1 change. You can use MCC to add new peripherals or reconfigure the existing peripheral, generate code or update packages using the MCC Content Manager. You can go to the project configuration path and check the various files to understand how the project is implemented. This demo application reads the current room temperature from the IO1 Explain Pro extension kit. The readings are displayed on the serial console every 500 milliseconds. LED1 toggles with each update. The periodicity of the timeout can be changed by pressing switch SW1. To verify, open a terminal application on your PC such as TerraTerm and set up the serial port. Select the connected hardware tool from the project properties, then build and program the kit. You can see the temperature reading on the serial console. The periodicity of the timeout will change from 500 milliseconds to 1 second, 2 seconds, 4 seconds and back to 500 milliseconds every time you press the switch SW1 on the board. Also, LED1 toggles with each temperature reading. Navigate to the link shown on the screen for more application demos for the Curiosity PIC32 MZEF 2.0 development board or other development boards or kits through the MPLAB Discover. Also, please visit microship.com slash harmony to learn more about MPLAB Harmony V3 features, benefits and other information. We hope you enjoyed this brief demonstration. Thanks for watching.